An esteemed actor, Michael York has left an indelible mark on the film industry with his roles in timeless classics. Over the years, he showcased remarkable versatility, earning praise for his performances in movies such as Cabaret and The Three Musketeers. What distinguishes him from his peers is his seamless transformation into a diverse array of characters, captivating audiences through nuanced portrayals. His on-screen charisma and unwavering dedication have garnered widespread acclaim, setting him apart during his era. Delving into lesser-known aspects, York's ability to effortlessly immerse himself in roles stems from a genuine passion for his craft. His presence on screen is not just about acting, it's about creating a connection that resonates with viewers worldwide. As we explore more facets of Michael York's fascinating life and career, stay tuned for additional insights into the man behind the roles. Discover surprising, amusing, and poignant details that add layers to his legacy. A renowned actor has made significant contributions to cinema through various notable projects. Among the standout movies, one features him alongside Liza Minnelli as Brian Roberts in a musical drama. Another showcases his versatility and depth as an actor in a sci-fi film where he portrays a character named Logan Five. Additionally, he takes on the role of Dier Tugnan in two adventurous movies based on classic literature. For those unfamiliar with his work, the musical drama is a great starting point, offering an engaging story and outstanding performances. The sci-fi film provides insight into his range as an actor, while the adventurous movies offer an escape into classic literature brought to life on screen. In summary, his filmography includes several must-watch movies, each showcasing his talent and leaving a lasting impression on audiences. In 1987, he found himself playing a significant role as a jury member at the respected Venice Film Festival, which added another important chapter to his career. Known for his memorable performances in famous movies like Romeo and Juliet and The Three Musketeers, he brought characters to life effortlessly, leaving a lasting impression on movie history. His adventures and historical dramas didn't stop there. He returned to his role in The Four Musketeers' Milady's Revenge, showing that he was good at playing different kinds of characters. He might not have known then how these movies would influence future works like the well-known play Serrano de Bergerac. Although there's been some confusion about his birth name, it's important to clear things up. Contrary to some sources, his real name is Michael Hugh Johnson. The story behind why he chose the name York is interesting. It seems he got the idea from a popular English cigarette brand. This decision not only shaped who he was, but also became a fun fact about his life. In short, this actor's journey from film festivals to playing various roles shows his lasting impact on entertainment. The stories of Romeo and Juliet, The Musketeers, and Serrano de Bergerac are all part of his career, a story that continues to unfold on screens around the world. In one instance, he got involved in the making of Death on the Nile, an exciting project full of mystery and excitement. The real highlight, though, happened during the filming of Logan's Run. On the first day of shooting, the director and producer decided his character, Logan, should have a more laid-back vibe. Costume designer Bill Thomas had to think on his feet and quickly put together a black house robe for him to wear on set. Surprisingly, this robe became a special keepsake from his time on the film. Despite its simple start, the robe meant a lot to him, even though he jokes about not wearing it much. It reminded him of the creative process and the strong bond he shared with the cast and crew during Logan's run. Interestingly, this wasn't the only project he did with Jenny Agutter. They also worked together in The Riddle of the Sands in September, strengthening their professional relationship and friendship. The entertainment world is full of such stories where seemingly ordinary moments turn into cherished memories. Every project and role leave a lasting impact on the actors, shaping their careers and leaving behind a trail of interesting stories. The tale of the Black House robe, quickly put together but deeply meaningful, is a great example of the creative spirit in filmmaking and the connections formed on set. This is just one part of his remarkable career story, a tale that will be remembered for years to come. In his roles, he played different characters alongside famous actors like Charlton Heston. They were set to work together again in a movie called Gulliver's Travels, but it never happened. Even though he was unsure at first, he eventually took on a role in the island of Dr. Moreau. His performances showed how versatile he was, playing various characters in different kinds of movies. He worked with respected actors and directors, which made his acting stand out. In a game of tennis, our main character in Logan's run noticed a captivating blonde, who later secured the role of Holly after a recommendation to the casting director. This actor appeared in two films nominated for the Best Picture Oscar, one in 1968 and another in 1972. 
Interestingly, he shares two roles with Malcolm McDowell and John Gielgud. McDowell portrayed King Arthur in Arthur the King, while our actor took on the same character in A Knight in Camelot. Furthermore, McDowell played Merlin in Kids of the Round Table, with our actor playing the wizard in A Young Connecticut Yankee in King Arthur's Court. Lastly, Gielgud played Merlin in Quest for Camelot, adding another layer to these shared roles. Intriguing connections in the world of cinema. In the world of acting, a notable incident occurred during the filming of The Four Musketeers' Milady's Revenge. Charlton Heston, portraying Cardinal Richelieu, suggested a new line for the script, inspired by his research for the role. Director Richard Lester agreed to its inclusion, enhancing the movie's dialogue and adding depth to the character dynamics. This collaborative effort not only elevated the scene, but also highlighted the creative synergy among the cast and crew. Throughout his career journey, he made a significant move by joining the National Theater, marking a pivotal moment in his acting pursuits. It was a decision that shaped his artistic trajectory and solidified his commitment to the craft. Amidst the hustle and bustle of the entertainment industry, he found solace and inspiration in the theatrical realm, honing his skills and expanding his repertoire with each performance. His wife, Pat, is a talented American photographer sharing his life beyond the spotlight. Together, they navigate the intricacies of fame and fortune, finding joy in simple moments and cherishing the bonds of partnership. As he continues to captivate audiences with his charisma and versatility, he remains grounded by the love and support of his family and friends. He initially wasn't sure about playing Logan in a movie, but decided to do it after thinking about it. He did a great job, and people really liked his acting. In another movie called Sword of Gideon, he had a big role and did well, showing he's good at acting with other talented actors. He worked with famous director Steven Spielberg in two movies, showing he can do different types of roles. In one movie, he played a character from a Bible story, and people really liked his performance. Some scenes from that movie were used in another one, where he inspired a famous line. Overall, he's become a well-known and respected actor in the entertainment world because of his different roles and good acting. In the making of a classic adventure film, the director took a bold approach, using multiple cameras and continuous shots instead of the usual single camera method. During rehearsals, there were some memorable moments where the lead actor performed daring stunts like leaping onto horses with loose saddles, creating a whirlwind of dust and excitement. Apart from his work on screen, the actor co-wrote a book about preparing for Shakespearean roles with a colleague. This collaboration offers valuable insights into the art of acting. Interestingly, the actor shares three roles with another performer. They both portrayed the same character in different adaptations of a famous tale. Additionally, they both took on iconic roles in separate projects, showcasing their versatility and talent. These stories from his career highlight his diverse experiences in both literature and film.